Hello everybody, welcome to Geek Universe's gameplay update. I'm David the Man Zombie. We're going to talk about some uh, gaming news from this last week. So, last week, PlayStation 4 gamers got a chance to play the alpha version of one of this year's most talked about games, Destiny. While it was a PS4 exclusive, Bungie, the game's developers, released some stats like 6.5 million people played the alpha. They also measured things like how many kills with a primary weapon, 149,522,213, versus secondary weapons, 21,782,610, control points captured in the Crucible, deathless medals awarded in the Crucible, uh, splatters in the Sparrow, public events joined, and guardians served in dance parties. I don't actually know what half of this means, but it, it sounds cool. And I'm really excited to see how this game plays exactly like Halo on July 7th. On Monday, John Graham, co-founder and COO of the Humble Bundle, announced that the digital distributor has raised $1 million for charities. Uh, the service, which donates 10% of every sale to charity, only started last November. The co-founder went on to say, $1 million for charity is a big deal. In six months, the Humble Bundle store has grown from a mere humble experience to something that gamers and game developers, big and small, want to be a part of. See, there is still good in the world, especially the gaming world. In a that's weird type of news story, the city of Oakland will has just lifted a ban of pinball machines that has been in place since 1930. See, back in the old days, pinball machines didn't have those flippers that we all know and love. That meant that old school pinball machines were all about chance, with the addition of payouts from the establishment, meaning that the pinball was actually gambling, hence why there was a ban to begin with. Since then, flippers were added and people continued to play pinball, making the band completely silly and ridiculous and not even useful. So, good on you, Oakland, for getting around to something like this 80 years later. And that is your gaming news, as random as it may have been this week. So until next week... I got nothing. I'll just... You'll see me later, I'm going to blab about game news, so it'll be good. Goodbye.